All right, what is up, everyone? Um, I wanted to take some time to quickly go over the process for converting previously made textures um, to new Pample Box bundles. I'm going to use boards as an example. I just uploaded some templates um, or base bundles of the boards that you can easily just swap out the textures using Unity Asset Bundle Extractor Avalonia. Um, which is similar to the process as creating the boards um, previous to Pample Box release. So go ahead and download Unity Asset Bundle Extractor Avalonia from the Resources channel. Um, and additionally, I would recommend downloading Asset Studio. Uh, this will be used for extracting textures and meshes from Unity games. In this quick little tutorial, I'm going to go over um, assuming that you no longer have the textures from the board that you may have previously made, um, or if you, um, you know, would like to rip the textures from another board that somebody has made and the creator is not converting it to Pamplebox, uh, you can do so yourself uh, so that you have the textures added. So after both of these are installed, let's go ahead and head down to the textures old method. I'm going to go to boards. And I'm going to find one that I would like to convert. So I see here this one is replacing the GNU Pro Choice. So let's go ahead. I'm going to download this. And now I'm going to open up Asset Studio. So once that's downloaded and I have Asset Studio open, I'm going to go to my downloads folder and I'm going to drag this over into Asset Studio. And it's going to load the files. I'll go to Asset List. I'm going to filter by type by simply clicking on type. And now you can see the texture. So we have this. Here's the base texture here. That does have, looks like two normal maps. That's not normal, <laughs> despite the name. Okay, since these look like they are normal maps, um, I'm actually going to go ahead and just simply grab the base texture. I'm going to export this. Let's save it somewhere that will remember it. I'm going to go ahead and do it in my Shredder's Gear boards file. Let's just say tutorial. And I'm going to select this folder to export that. So now it pulls up here. So next, we are going to go over to the boards under Pample Box Gear. I have uploaded some templates here. So we're going to find GNU Pro Choice. I'm going to open this up. So now here is a base bundle file. All we need to do is replace the base texture and swap it out. So I'm going to download this. Okay, so now I'm going to open up Unity Asset Bundle Extractor Avalonia. And similar to Asset Studio, you can just drag and drop this file into here, select info. I'm going to filter by texture. So there's going to be a normal layer, a graphic and a metal. Graphic is going to be the base texture. Normal is going to be the normal layer, obviously, and metal is going to be the metallic layer, which adds your glossiness and shine. Um, we only downloaded the base graphic, so I'm going to just select graphic, go into plugins. Edit texture, click OK, going to load. And then now we're going to go to the location where I saved that file, which was under boards, tutorial, texture 2D, GNU Pro Choice. I hit open, save, file saved. Yes, I want to complete my changes. Okay, and here's the most important part, is the saving. So I do want to go to File, Save As. I'm going to find my location for Pamplebox, Gears, Boards. There should be a folder already for texture swaps for base skins. If not, you can create that. And now I do have some folders already. I'm going to go into GNU Pro Choice. And now I'm going to name it what the board was named here, which was the Burton Sean White Collection. So I'll just copy that. 
we'll go back in to our file here. We'll name it Burton Sean White Collection, however you want to name that. Just make sure at the end that it is a dot bundle. That's the most important part when saving the file name. Anything else here doesn't really matter. Just whatever you would like for it to be named. But it does need to say dot bundle at the end. So we're going to save that. And now we will close out of this and launch our game. All right, so now that we're in game, just check Pample Box really quickly. Go into Boards, Texture Swap Base Skins. We saved it under GNU Pro Choice. You'll see we do now have the Burton Sean White Collection 2019. So I'm going to select this just to show you why this isn't the first step we want to take. I click that. You can see the board is gray. And that's because the board that I currently have equipped is actually the Capita Mercury, not the GNU Pro Choice. So what we need to do is go into our in-game character customization. Here in stats, go to boards, and then find the GNU Pro Choice. Go ahead and equip. Back out. You can see we have that selected. So now I'm going to go into Pample Box and select the Burton Sean White collection. And now you can see the texture has been swapped and we have our custom board. So yeah, a few extra steps, um, but honestly, the process is pretty much the same as far as texture swaps are concerned. Um, you just need to make sure that you're replacing the proper texture file um, and have the ones that you need prior to doing the texture swap. Um, if there are any questions, feel free to reach out and let me know. Otherwise, keep shredding.